Still here in northern Alabama and we happened to be driving by and saw these monuments here and it's recognizing this monument in memory of the brave men who wore gray from the free state of Winston during the war between the states. Okay, so what we learned about Alabama is that Winston County in Alabama did not join the Confederacy, so they called it the Free State of Winston. Um, and that's what that meant when they were honoring those soldiers. Here is a memorial statue here. I'll show you. And it is a soldier. He's depicted as half Confederacy, half Union to commemorate both um, troops and both men's lives who died, which I think is amazing because down here in the south you usually find just the memorials for the Confederate soldiers who died, but this one actually shows and dedicates it for both sides. Both sides. Are you being the soldier? Yes. No. Hold on. Look, a sword is broken. It's be broken because broken lives. Hey, look, and look at this arch. He's stepping on. He's stepping on the sword. Okay, so we've got Union over here on this side. Yeah, he's stepping and on his sword. On this side, they have the Confederate flag on this side for him. Um, the kids have pointed out to me. He does have a broken sword here. And look, and and there's he, he's stepping on He's actually sword. stepping on that broken sword. Mom, what are the pink bows There's for? a bunch of pink so bows You guys don't normally see one for both. He's honoring both sides. One half Confederate symbolizes the war with it. It was the war within a war and honors the Winstonians in both armies. That's pretty amazing. sword is broken to represent the, their spirit that was broken by the end of the war. We are here at the Bankhead National Forest in northern Alabama and we are camped out at um, the Corinth uh, campground right now. So we are here. I have found the coolest uh, tree. I have to show you guys this with these large leaves. It is amazing. Check it out. big compared to all of these like pine trees and other trees that are out here so it's like it's just like this random tree with these Jurassic Park looking leaves on it just in the middle of this forest it's so cool Upper from the We're on the top part of the park. On the top part of the park. You can see quick on there. So. There you go. Do you want to be on Grandma's jacket? Yeah. Uh, in my jacket. It's, Hi. it's cold. Yeah. Aww, I want to be in that Grandma's jacket. Oh. No, wait. Ah. Yeah, yeah. Well, that, I'm, she's, she wants people away from me. I love it. Yay, Giant Grandma, Giant. for the win! Oh, I can't take her over this. So. Okay, our video camera is never gonna do this justice, but you guys, this is the Kenlock Falls here. 
and at Bank Hood National Forest in Northern Alabama and it is so beautiful. Wow, Liberty! Mom, this looks like a mermaid lagoon! She wants to jump in. I think she wants to commit suicide. <laughs> <laughs> This looks like a mermaid lagoon! I got her. I'm not watching this. Uh, Takeoff has decided to play. Okay! I don't want to watch. It's not very deep, but Jeff thinks that if it was warmer, he would jump right in. Let's see. Somebody left a rope over here, so the kids have been swinging on it on this tree. Well, moving so he doesn't get smashed. Woo! 